What's going on everybody? My name is Mantra and welcome to my channel. This is where I react to TV shows, movies, and other things that I find interesting. And today we are getting into WandaVision Season 1 Episode 8. Now before we get on with this reaction, I want to let everyone know that I do have a Patreon. Over at Patreon, you can see all my reactions uncut, unedited. You also get them weeks, weeks, weeks ahead of YouTube. So if you guys want to check that out, you guys want to support me, links are going to be in the description for that. And also you can find me streaming over on Twitch. I stream about two or three times a week. I play a variety of games. Come hang out. We have a whole bunch of fun. Links going to be in the description for that as well. And of course, you guys like my reactions, like my content, please consider hitting that subscribe button. That really helps out the channel too. All right, on to WandaVision. I wrote a couple things from a last week's episode. Look, a couple things that stood out to me. All right, so one, Wanda is having trouble controlling her powers, right? I think it's because the hex is getting too big. She enlarged the hex, thus she cannot control her powers. And then apparently it's been Agatha all along. That I don't believe. Okay, apparently Agatha is someone. I don't know who Agatha is, but all, all, everyone's on the internet is like, oh, it's Agatha. I don't even know who that is. So Agnes is playing the character of Agatha, and Agatha is a real villain, I guess. But I don't believe it. I don't buy it, dude. I, I really think Wanda is still behind everything, and Agatha is the cover-up, like the scapegoat, like the backup. Agatha is going to take all the blame, but it's actually Wanda doing everything still. That's what I believe. I could be wrong, okay? It could be Agatha all along, like, they, like that stupid music video said. But but anyways, let's just get on with the episode. Previously on, that's the name of the episode, previously on. All of these titles for this season, they've all been TV related, right? Like Now in Color or Previously On or, you know, whatever. But anyways, let's get on with the reaction. Season one, episode eight, WandaVision, let's go. Boom. Bum, 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 bum. All right, here we go. It's been Agatha all along, guys. Did you guys hear that about that one? Salem? 1700. Uh -huh. What the hell is this? What? Oh no. What the heck is that? They're seriously gonna burn Agatha? No. Or Agnes? I don't know what to call her now. Are you a witch? They're literally giving us history on the villain. This is crazy. Yet you have betrayed your coven. Huh? You practice the darkest of magic. The witches are burning her. Oh. They simply bent to my power. What the hell? Is this for reals? Is this serious? Maybe my whole theory is wrong. I cannot control it. I... Oh, Help me! Enough deception. Mother! Mother? Please. That's her mom? Oh no. Okay, what are they doing to her? Oh, jeez. She's glowing from the inside. Oh, what the hell? That looks really cool. But what are they doing to her? What the heck? Does she absorb all that magic? No. Oh, what? She's that powerful? Where's mom going? Mom's like, I'm out. Uh oh. Why'd you do that, Mom? You're done, Mom. You're done. Oh my god. This is pretty crazy. Oh shit. I can be good. No, you cannot. What kind of spells are these that they're doing? I have no idea what kind of magic this is. Uh-oh, careful. Let go, let go. Let go, mom. Oh, you fucked up. Why did they, why she even try that move? Oh, jeez. And then she took all that power from all of them. Wiped out all her sisters. I don't think she feels any remorse. Doesn't look like it. Okay. She does look shocked to meet the real us, doesn't she? <laughs> oh, that's adorable. My thoughts are not available to you, Tuts. What? So she really is a villain. Where are my children? Where are my children? <laughs> She's so funny. Where are they? Ooh, 
no power is down here. The magic's no good here. <gasps> oh shit! She is a real villain. These are runes, Wanda. Only the witch that cast the runes can use her magic. Who are you? Yeah, who, who are, are you? you? I got close with fake Pietro. Pietro, if you will. <laughs> Pietro! You're even running illusions miles away at the edge of town! Magic oh. on autopilot! She's jelly. She's peanut butter and jelly sandwich. What's your secret, dude? sister? She's OP. She's OP. I need you to tell me how you did this. She's I didn't do She's OP. I'm not. No! Uh-oh. Better start talking, homie. All right. Let's go. No. Did you forget who's got your children stashed away in her bewitched basement? Ooh, damn, that's fucked up, dude. That's evil. After you. All right. Superstar. Such a good episode so far. Mama. Oh, excuse me. Papa. Whoa. Oh, Bewitched, I love Lucy, Malcolm in the middle, what the hell? Oh, Wanda, that's all WandaVision right there in that suitcase. This is so interesting. Like, we're actually getting the answer to like, why WandaVision? Oh my God, all this is going on outside? Season two, episode 21. Dick Van Dyke, okay. The Dick Van Dyke show. Man, and there's a war going on outside? I don't know if it's a war, but something's going on. So I guess she resonates the WandaVision show with, with her family and growing up with her family. While there's like hella shit going down. Look at that one. Vision walked through that right there on the first episode. And that's the second episode. Holy shit. Oh my god, this is actually pretty sad because she's so happy right now. Look at her. It's probably the happiest moments of her life. This is crazy. What the fuck, dude? Holy shit, they just got blown up. So what I see here is a baby witch obsessed with sitcoms and years of therapy ahead of her. Yeah. Where'd you get the big guns, Wanda? True. Yeah, where'd she get her powers from? Are they answering everything this episode? I feel like she got found and got experimented on, right? Yeah, when people have like a crazy ass trauma, they always kick back to what they were doing right before the trauma happened. Because the things they were doing right before the trauma, that was like their normal life. And then when the trauma happened, they don't have a normal life anymore. They have another on another path. So they always kick back to the moment right before the path went that way, which is whatever you were doing at that moment, like last. So the last thing she was doing is watching, you know, sitcoms before everything went down another path. Tesseract or whatever is that? Isn't that Loki staff? Is the power in that staff one of the infinity stones or am I stupid? Let me know in the comments. Not one subject has survived direct contact. So why does she uh, survive? Whoa. Whoa. Oh shit. That's why she's so OP. And I guess they wanted to train her and use her as a weapon, huh? Oh shit, Scarlet Witch, straight up. Whoa, that was cool! That was awesome! That was a Scarlet Witch coming at her. She looks creepy as fuck, dude. Again. Oh, the tape wiped. So, little orphan Wanda got up close and personal with an infinity stone. Damn, they're explaining everything about Scarlet Witch. The Avengers compound. It was the first home Vision and I ever shared. Pietro was dead. This is all real stuff during Avengers. The yeah. only thing that would bring me comfort is seeing him again. Um, uh, Pedro. I'm so tired. So she lost Pedro and then she lost Vision. So she's going a little, a little nutty. But what is grief, if not love, persevering? Hey, relax, Vision. Jeez. Yes, it was very funny, wasn't it? Mm -hmm. 
Oh. Dude, this episode's awesome. Parents dead, brother dead. Mm hmm, mm hmm. Vision dead. Mm hmm. What happened when he wasn't there to pull you back from the darkness, Wanda? Mm hmm. So Vision was helping her grieve about Pedro, but no one was there for Wanda to, to help her grieve about Vision. But you wanted him back. Here we go. Let's go. Here we go. I wanted him back. Dude, the music's picking up all crazy. He was gone. And I know he's here. He deserves a funeral, at least. I deserve it. Gosh, she's scary. Ah! I got it. Thanks. Dude, she looks like a badass. Wanda Maximoff. It's an honor to meet you. Huh? They met and talked before, huh? I'd like to show you something. And then you'll give him to me. Please, just come with me. Oh, what is he gonna show her? Hmm. Mm -hmm. Whoa. Oh shit. What is this? Why are you showing me this? That's him. That's Vision, no? He was in pieces? What the hell? Oh god. She saw him like that? We're dismantling the most sophisticated sentient weapon ever made. I just want to bury him. Are you sure? Are you sure about that? The best I can do is let you say goodbye to him. He isn't yours. What did you say? Oh, why'd you fucking say that, you dumbass? Oh my god. Here we go. You pissed her off. Fall back. It's fine. He's letting her? Hmm. Let her see for herself. I can't feel you. This is crazy. I know I said it already, but it's such a good episode. And she left. She left. Hmm. Okay. I'm confused. All right, here's Westview. Normal Westview. Before Wanda took over, but how did she get Vision? Because she just left? Okay. To grow olden. V, Vision. They bought a house in Westview. They were planning to live in Westview. And Wanda did it, but she had that nervous breakdown. Oh God, this is heartbreaking, Jesus. This is sick, dude. Oh, shit. How the hell is she making him? So is this not really him then? Is the real vision destroyed and this isn't vision? What the fuck? So this vision is really isn't vision, is it? That's what I'm thinking. Holy shit. That was cool. Should we stay in tonight? Fuck. I called it nervous breakdown. Damn, they literally answered all questions in this episode. The kids, Tommy Billy. Mom, hey, dude, you better fucking let them go. That makes you a Scarlet Witch. Ah, oh, come on, dude. Yeah, she's a Scarlet Witch. What do you mean? We like I've always known her as the Scarlet Witch, but she's talking about the Scarlet Witch that she saw from the Infinity Stone, right? All right, you know, we gotta check for after scene credits because they like to get us sometimes and there is one. You're the Scarlet Witch as if like that's a big reveal. Like, didn't we all know that? Like, I don't even know her as Wanda, really. I just call her Wanda because everyone calls her Wanda, but I've always known her as Scarlet Witch. Like, she's Scarlet Witch, I don't know. Am I tripping? All right, here we go. We took this thing apart and put it back together again a million times. They put Vision back together. Oh shit, what? That's real vision. Okay. Okay. Next episode's gonna be big. 
So that was my reaction for WandaVision Season 1, Episode 8. And I got to say, best episode of the season. This was a really good episode, not just for WandaVision, but in TV in general. For TV shows, like, this was a really good episode. I think I liked it because they explained all the answers. I mean, who's not going to like this episode? All right, so let's go over a couple things. And they were trying to make it seem this season like she stole him. But we found out in this episode that she didn't steal him, right? She made a fake vision. So now we know that he's fake. And that's why he doesn't remember anything before WandaVision. But the episode we find out he's fake, it's also the episode that we find out he's back together and the real Vision is alive because we just saw in the end credit after the end credits that he's put together and back alive. I honestly find that a little cheap. Like he wasn't, we thought he was real the whole time, but the moment we find out he's not real, we find out that there's a real him like right at that same moment. I don't know. It feels a little cheap to me, but uh, let's see what's going on. Agatha has the kids by the throat. Don't do that. You're one of my favorite characters and you're not being my favorite character right now. So don't do that. And then we got everything from Wanda. She's always been obsessed with TV shows and it was like a family thing. So she resonates her family with sitcoms, which is why she chose WandaVision. And I thought it was, it, it was the happiest moment in her, of her life. And it's also like, like I was saying earlier, how when you take that path, you always kick back to the moment where you were like living your normal life, being happy before your your life went this path that went to shit. So that's why she did that. It's It comes from trauma. A lot of trauma victims will do that. They'll kick back to, um, to, the, to the point where things went haywire, like right before that part. They'll kick back to whatever they were doing because that's when they were living their normal happy life. Okay, and then she got the powers from the Affinity Stone and you can see Scarlet Witch. I'm looking at it right now. You can see Scarlet Witch flying at her. So there was a Scarlet Witch previously before Wanda. So I guess Scarlet Witch is like a spirit or some type of like entity that goes from per from being to being. And whoever the being is, is the Scarlet Witch. And right now it's Wanda. Is that what's going on? Because I never knew that. I always thought Wanda was Scarlet Witch. I always thought she was just a superhero and that's that. But I guess an entity chose her body. Makes a lot of sense. Best episode of the season. All of my questions are answered. Next episode, I, sh I feel like shit's gonna go down. That's when the battle's gonna happen or war or whatever. Conclusion. This is my favorite episode of the season. I don't think they're gonna top it next episode. I'm not, I'm, I don't know. I really don't know. Next episode, I'm sure it's gonna be badass, but um, I liked hearing everything answered because when people watch the first episode of the season, what everyone's just confused, right? Like, what the hell is going on? What the hell is going on? This literally answered everything. Now we're like, oh, okay. Literally all the questions got answered. This was legit. I liked it a lot. If I'm, if I'm not mistaken, the next episode is going to be the last one of the season, right? Right? We'll see how that goes. Those are my thoughts on the episode. What did you guys think? Like always, let me know in the comments down below. If you guys like my reaction, go ahead and hit that like button. It really helps out the video. It helps send this video through this crazy algorithm of YouTube. So if you guys like my video and like my reaction, go ahead and hit that like button. But that's going to be it. I'll see you guys in the next reaction. Don't do drugs. Keep it, keep it safe. Peace.